DC themselves is telling y'all that Batman is garbage as a hero. We're going to look at two recent books. This new Doom Patrol that just came out today. And that GCPD, the Blue Wall, issue 6 that came out last week. So in the new Doom Patrol, Batman pop up to try to help the fucking Doom Patrol because they was in Gotham and shit. He was like, we'll handle it from here. Jane, as you can see at the bottom, she was like, like hell you will, Batman. This isn't a crime scene. It's a rescue mission. Batman was like, that's not your decision to make, Jane. Jane isn't here right now. You're talking to the team's new chief. I don't care who you are. This is my city. He'll be taken care of. Arkham's Tower is preparing a special holding cell until... No good has ever come out of a cell in Arkham. At best, he'll become one of your enemies. And at worst, another one of their victims. That isn't a fair assessment. Arkham is only a temporary... And then what? Star Labs, where he'll endure more experiments? The Suicide Squad to become a weapon for the government? You don't understand the problems people like us face, Batman. You aren't a metal human. And I'm calling out one of the creators I know on his app. Skip later in the story, Batman said, hold on, Chief. The Justice League was... And then she was like, the Justice League is full of a group of aliens, Amazons, and Atlanteans, and some humans with special gadgets. The only regular member on that team with the active metagene is too fast to ever be caught. The rest of us aren't so lucky. Robin said she got a point. Robin Batman said, not now, Robin. After they got the uh, degenerate ass on the squad to join the Doom Patrol, Mary Jane was like, no civilian casualties, no one died, and I know your investigation will uncover Medellin's crimes. As for the Subject 99, he's coming with us, Batman. Batman ain't say shit. Fine, we'll try it your way this time. Nice, but I will be watching. We don't care. I wasn't asking you or anyone else for permission. And y'all remember that damn brain from that villain place and shit that always got that monkey with him? Yeah, the monkey finally killed that brain. Ain't none of that shit no more. Gotta wait till the next issue to see what's going down with that. All right, let's look into the GCPD. So the question up here looking for this little boy that's been running around up here killing people and killing cops and shit, right? Six people dead, Commission. Right about now, when's Gordon would have been calling in Batman? Maybe that's the problem. Maybe if Gordon hadn't leaned so hard on Batman back in the day, we'd be able to better handle the real badness now. A crazy clown? A guy dressed up as a penguin? They're nothing compared to a kid carrying an AR-15 and a whole lot of hate. I'm going. Where? To do what I should would have done from the start. So she leaves and she goes to this building right here, right? Because she finally located that boy that she was talking about earlier. She get there and that's when the conversation get really good. Danny. How'd you find me? Who gave me up? Eric Wells, I deed your vehicle. Sam Park gave me your dad's phone. They were supposed to be my friends. Maybe them trying to get you off the streets is what friendships look like. Danny, don't. I'm unarmed. I don't care, I'll shoot you anyway. I gotta be honest with you, at this point, that's not much of a threat. Everything that happened is your fault. Lots of people get dumped on, Danny. They don't all go get guns and execute innocent people. If I hadn't killed people, we wouldn't be having this conversation. You wouldn't be wondering what you could have done different. You wouldn't be thinking about what you could, what you would do better. If you survive this, police is on their way and they're not thinking about whether or not to shoot. All they're thinking about is how quickly they can reload. You won't be dead? Above all, I'm a police officer. It can never be about what we want, Danny. It's about the law. The law says I have to do everything I can to take you alive. And if you die, then you just another one of those crazies in the city full of psychotics. And you don't even get a fancy nickname. If you live, you live to tell your story. And maybe, I don't know, maybe it makes a difference to somebody. Not much as choices go, but however it is, you need to decide now. Wee -woo, wee -woo, wee -woo. Get on the ground! Here's where we can see him! So the motherfucking police and shit get him right, and they take him in custody alive. So she had a press conference to go in front of the place to go talk about everything that's going on with the GCPD, right? This is where we get on the news where they tell you like, shit, we don't care about none of that extra shit that's been going on. All we do know is that crime in the city is going down thanks, that's because of her. It says right here, crime in this city is down. That's all that matters. This ain't the only book where they be coming at his ass about the shit that he be doing. Even in the fail safe shit, he was coming at himself on how fucked up he was fucking up them damn citizens see shit like this and they up here hyping his ass up 
Remember, DC tells your ass itself, the fucking city is full of psychotics. And all he gonna do to fucking try to save people is to lock they ass up in Arkham. And DC said it they self, there's no good that come with that shit. They either become your enemies, or they either become victims of the motherfuckers that you fucking sent there. And you tried to make an excuse of it. When she treated your ass though, that's when you realize, like, you knew that she was telling the truth. That's why you sat there and let this shit go down. Because you like, man, my shit do be fucked up. But I'm going to watch. Because as soon as it fucked up, I'm going to be there to tell you. I told you. I told you so. I'm going to go back to doing what the fuck I was doing. Even though it didn't work, I'm still going to do what the fuck I was doing. Because I am Batman. I'm just saying, man. They keep on writing this shit. Keep telling y'all this shit. But y'all ignore that shit and try to bring up this shit. 